time to turn in some coupons and get three chests. Awesome. We're going to walk out of here at uh, four or five, seven guns. What's up, my doomed friends? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Last Day on Earth Survival! The only thing that's not going to survive this bunker is the zombies. Okay, guys, last video, we decided to come back to the bunker. We need to grind for that chopper. We need the chopper! So that's what we got to do, man. We got to come down here. We got to finish this up. Uh, that's what we're going to do today. We're going to actually finish up the bunker. We're going to open three chests. I got plenty of coupons. We got chests. Chests! Chests for days! You know it. All right. We're also going to be talking about a new update that's going to be coming out soon that has to do with armor but um we will talk about that a little bit later all right let's get this started if you haven't enjoying the video please remember to uncage that like button also if you are new here please subscribe for more daily videos so let's go ahead and chop up some zombies and we're gonna go ahead and put this on auto and we're just gonna kind of have a little bit of a, of a meal here i think i'm actually gonna start using these as well um the healing items because i've got so many freaking healing items it's not even funny remember we are going to leave the ch the loot down here we're, we're gonna come back for it at a later date okay all right, so let's uh, let's clear this place out. Okay, so before we get started, I actually want to go over this update because um, I'm afraid I'm going to forget, to be perfectly honest. Uh, right now, I am going to put on the screen a picture that the developers uh, posted on their Facebook page. All right, it should be on your screen right now. And it is for armor upgrades, okay? The developers are talking about an update coming down the road where we will be able to upgrade our armor. Look at how sick this freaking armor looks. I mean, you got your regular guy, and then you got your regular guy with like some leather armor. Um, then you got your guy with, I'm guessing that's like uh, the tier two armor. That Now you're starting to get badass. Look at that hard leather armor, and then you got tactical armor, and then you got some kind of Mad Max metal armor. That stuff looks sick. That stuff looks sick. I can't wait for that update. I think it's going to be freaking awesome. Um, I cannot wait to upgrade my armor and look like a badass. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, what do you guys think about the armor? You think it's going to be uh, badass or what? I mean... I mean, just look at it. It's, it's definitely going to be badass. But tell me how badass do you think it's going to be? On a scale of 10 to 11, how badass is that armor going to be, right? All right, so let's go ahead and kill these guys. And this thing will probably break. There we go. That is fine. I'm okay with that. Um, let's go ahead and heal. I'm just going to keep running back. I don't like fighting in this hallway because I don't want to get that uh, giant by mistake. Put, the, put ourselves in auto. Go like this. And bring this one back. There we go. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to uh, break these, uh, you know, I have a lot of weapons that are very low in durability and I'm just trying to get rid of them, you know, while still making use out of them. So, yeah, we gotta be, we gotta be wary of that giant. He can see you through the glass. So, um, I don't really have, well, actually, I, I'm gonna kill him. As soon as I can get to him, I'm gonna kill him because I don't like him there. He, he ticks me off. All right, so let's come on over here, and this is just going to be some toxic spitters. So we're going to go ahead and use the machete. You know, you guys might be thinking the machete is a really great weapon, and you know the machete is a pretty good weapon. But, but there's some dude on the on the on Reddit that I heard from uh, Yippee Ki Yay, Mr. Falcon. This dude like did like all these tests and stuff, and decided that the best weapon in the game, damage wise versus durability, is actually the spiked devastator. That's pretty crazy, right? So, yeah, the Spike Devastator is supposed to be, like, the um, the best weapon now. So, I'm going to be making Spike Devastators. Sounds pretty cool. I actually like the Spike Devastator. I just didn't know it was the best weapon in the game. <laughs> Who would have thought? Let's see if we can outrange this turret. Um, again, I don't know what's going on with this update with the outrange of the turret. Really quickly, let me say this right off the bat. You guys got to understand, I record these episodes sometimes a day or two in advance. So, when I say the spitters are still broken and I can't dodge them... Um, you know, the developers of the game did an update uh, pretty fast to fix the spitters. So when I made that video and I was talking about how spitters um, could not be avoided, that was just, uh, you know, at the time. Um, so just keep that in mind, guys. If I'm making videos and I'm saying something that's not quite lining up with what you're seeing in game, just remember that, you know, sometimes these uh, videos are a couple days old and, so, and, you know, every once in a while a developer will uh, pop an update in there that will make what I'm saying irrelevant. And um, that's why... I, I thought you couldn't dodge... Well, you couldn't dodge the spitters at the time I was saying it. But I have since gone and checked on the spitters. And you can now dodge the spitters again. They have been fixed. All right, guys. I am all out of bows. Man, I got to bring a lot more bows. I got to bring a lot more bows. I run out of them way too quickly. Way too quickly. You know what? I think I want to one-shot this guy. Well, you know what? No, actually, I want to one-shot him. And the reason I want to one-shot him is because if I one-shot this guy, then his buddy over here, the Toxic Abomination, won't join. Right? If you one-shot him, he won't join. If you hit him and he, and he lives, then this guy will join. Now, I don't really mind fighting this guy. I don't mind this guy joining because this guy will be dead by the time he, the Toxic Abomination gets over here. The reason I don't want hit this guy to join is because then I can get a sneak attack on him as well. 
Okay, there you go. And now we can sneak attack this guy as well. Uh, do I have a lighter? No, no. This is the um, the weakest one I have. All right, so now you're going to get sneak attacked. Step back! Stop! Step back! Yeah! Got to make a step back song. That'd be awesome. Uh, do we want to kill this guy through here? Might as well, I guess. There's no reason not to. Um, but because I ran out of bows... I, well, actually, there is a reason not to, because I could, I could sneak attack him. And that is actually a very good reason not to shoot him through the fence. All right, so we're going to open this up. All right. Oh, got a couple of big boys in there. All right, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. All right, I don't want my clothes breaking, plus I want to I want to have some good defense against these guys. All right, there we go. Let's make sure we're full health. There we go. Okay, let's take these guys out. You big, stupid sons of... Okay. Stutter step! Stutter step! Stutter step! Stutter step! What? what? Stutter step! Yeah, that could be a that could be a cool song. Stutter step! Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get. Yeah, awesome, awesome. Give me a red ticket. Okay, I, I don't mind the yellows. The yellows are pretty cool too. All right, now we're fighting some little dinky guys. Let's uh, let's break this armor. I really like this armor to break. Let's try and break this uh, this machete as well. I'm not even gonna try and sneak attack these guys. I'm just gonna auto attack. Uh, actually, I'm going to start using some bandages, too. There we go. No resources to collect. What about the bodies, man? Loot the bodies! Alright, so we want to one-shot them. You know what? I don't even think I want to get a sneak attack on these guys, because if I get close enough to sneak attack them, then that uh, giant might add as well. I think I just want to fight these guys, like, so. Okay. There we go. All right, whatever. We're using a machete on him. Oh, we use this machete on him now. Okay. All right, breaking some some machetes. We're using more healing items than I might want to, but that's okay. I'm perfectly okay with that. So the reason we left this guy alive was so we could sneak attack him. Um, plus, all right. So we're gonna get two attacks on this guy. We're gonna get we're gonna get the sneak attack, which is going to do massive damage to start off the fight. And the other cool thing about what we're about to do is I can finish him off with the blade weapon when he's down low on hit points. So it's gonna save quite a few. Uh, quite a few shots from our gun. So we're gonna don't go too close to that door. There we go. Alright, very good. See that sneak attack does massive, massive damage. 55, say good night! Say good night! Yeah! Whoa, yeah. I love it. I love the gun. Do I have enough Oh yeah, plenty of plenty of thing to kill him. Come on, buddy, you're next. Line up, get smanked. Get smanked? I was, I was kind of going to say get spanked and get smacked. So I said get smanked. <laughs> whatever, Cage. Just just kill the freaking giant, get the loot. Say whatever dumb thing you want as long as you get the loot. Alright, that's cool. He's done. There's one down here. I could definitely sneak attack this guy. Uh, do I have two hits left on this thing? I think I do. I think I do. I'm going to get the sneak attack, and if it breaks, it breaks. Then I won't get the uh, last hit. That's fine. Yep, yeah, two, two shots off. Cool. Come on, you. I got an itchy trigger finger. Some people say, you know, the bow is awesome. And I do think the bow is awesome. The bow is really, really cool for taking out these giants. But there's one good thing about using weapons that you don't think about. By the way, level 87. There's one good thing about using weapons over the bow that is really cool. And it's time investment. I mean... I don't have all day here. You know what I mean? So sometimes I just like to kill stuff quick. Should I put on the rest of my stuff? I don't know. I'm not really sure. Yeah, I think I got... I think I got spitters around this corner, if I remember correctly. Uh, yeah, a couple spitters. They're not going to be able to do anything. All right, we're going to put this on, put this on, put this on. Uh, we don't have any boots. It's fine. I really don't care. All right. Can I get the sneak attack on this guy? I've never been able to do it before. Nope, I didn't think so. I don't really think it's possible. Alright, you're next. Clothes are breaking. The boots are gone. Um, we still got a little bit left in this stuff. Um, okay, with boots. Boots doesn't really give you armor. Not, not it doesn't really give you armor. Boots do not give you armor. So, you know what? Just let them stay broken. Alright, we're going to stutter step this guy. Stutter step! Stutter step! I like the word stutter step more. I mean, hey, you know, step back, step back trick is really cool. 
I mean, it's really, really cool. But I think Stutter Step has a better ring to it. Stutter Step! Stutter Step! You got Stutter Stepped! There you go. Alright, you're down. Alright, do we have to, what we need to kill this guy? We do not. Let me go back and get some other stuff. Alright guys, we're coming up on my favorite room, and for my favorite room, I've got my favorite gun. Actually, maybe I should use the pistol on this room. What do you think? The pistol, uh, what does this thing do? This thing does, well, the pistol's slower, isn't it? Let me see. This is damage uh, 15, 18.3. This is damage 24, 3.3. Uh, I'm gonna use a rifle. I like that, I like that uh, DPS. Okay, we're gonna get as far back as we can. And here we go. Okay, run away a little bit. Uh, do I want to throw a heal yet? I got my 100% heals, so I kind of want to wait a little bit. Yeah, now let's throw a heal. There we go. No point in dying, right? There you go. You die now. Okay. So, used up a pretty good amount of the gun, but to be perfectly honest, guys, I don't like dealing with that room. I really don't. I gotta come back here with more bows, though. I've been killing, um, I've been killing giants with, uh, guns too much on this floor. Um, I mean, I have a good amount of guns at home, but it doesn't mean I just want to, you know, be throwing guns away, you know? Well, I got plenty of guns, so I might as well use them. Nah, like, I like saving them. It's fun to save them. So, because of that, I think I will, I will bring a lot more bows here next time. Because, um, well, we can do it. Why not, right? Alright, let's see what's in this next room. I don't think this next room is anything bad. Couple of spitters. Uh, I think where there's a toxic abomination in here as well. Yes, okay. So because it's a toxic abomination, we want to one-shot this clown. There we go. And I don't think we're going to be able to get... Oh, you know what? Why don't we come up here? Why don't we come up here and try and get around behind that guy? Now there's going to be a uh, um, toxic abomination in this hallway right here. Which kind of sucks, but... Let's see what we can do here. Actually, we could probably still get... Maybe we should kill the Toxic Abomination first. Yeah, let's do that. Let's kill him first. Oh, that's the trick. Okay. I see what you're doing, game. That's interesting. So he made the other guys come. So they kind of make you think you could go and, like, you know, do that little trick. But no, it's not going to work. Interesting. You stupid game! You set me up! Weapon broke. Uh, you know what? Just punch him. There you go. I'll give you a machete. You're good to go. Cut his freaking guts out. Awesome. Okay, so we got those rooms cleared. That's nice. Got this room cleared. I think we got another giant coming up. Uh, we will use the pistol on him. I'm pretty sure the giant's next. Not 100% sure, but pretty sure. Pretty kind of sure. Kind of pretty sure. Yep. Can I one shot? Can I uh, sneak attack him? Uh, I don't think it's quite worth the try, but maybe we should try. It's not like he's gonna one shot me, right? All right, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Nope, didn't think so. I think I've tried before, but I don't know. I could be mistaken. All right, you're down, buddy. Say good night. Say good night. Boom! Cut your head off. Yeah, another red coupon. We're up to 35. I'd like to get as many red coupons as I can because next time I do the zone, I'd like to be able to turn in the red coupon uh, thing again. A red coupon. I want to call it its proper name. Combat gear coupon. So, I think at least I got the, the word coupon right this time instead of calling them tickets. Tickets. Makes me, makes me feel like I'm at a freaking amusement park. All right, guys, last room in the place. I'm pretty sure I've cleared out every room besides this one. Um, yeah, I do not want to use a gun in this room. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I don't even know why I was holding that gun. We go in this room, we put it on auto, we eat until we win. Right? Yeah, sounds good. All right. Eat to win! There we go. We'll use one of these just for the lulls. Come on. Can you get my hit points down well enough to make it worth it? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. 32? Nope. Not even worth it. You couldn't even do it, you stupid things. Alright, give me those useless green coupons, will you? <laughs> okay, guys, it's loot time. Let me get my inventory in order, and we're gonna come through here and loot the place. Okay, guys, wish me luck. We're gonna... We're not gonna do this one in the op... Last, uh... Last floor, floor two. We looted the floor opposite of the way we did it. 
um, and it didn't work out too well for us. It wasn't good loot. So because I'm su such a superstitious nut job, uh, I'm going to loot it in the order that I did it and see if that helps any. All right, I am slightly stinking. I guess um, I didn't take a shower last time I went back to base. I went back to base in between uh, in between videos, between this video and last video, and uh, I must have forgot to shower. So started getting stinky. What are you going to do? All right, awesome green coupon. Yeah, green coupon. By the way, uh, well, actually, let me loot this really quick before I get into the by the way. Let me uh, take a look at this. What do we got in this bad boy? Come on, give me something good. Or not. Uh, by the way, I did miss this room last time I was down here. You guys told me in the comments. I came here off camera and got the room. It wasn't anything big deal. Um, I got a red ticket off the uh, giant, but that was it. So uh, I didn't feel like that was worth putting in a recording. <laughs> It would have been a 30 second uh, video. All right. Um, oh, man. What? Oh, boy. This, um, oh, this loot. <laughs> this loot's not looking too good. But we've just started. So let's see what we got. I will probably grab the gas mask and go down in that gas room. But, man, that gas room was such crap last time. Oh, what a freaking travesty. <laughs> that freaking gas room, dude. Uh, I got that thing. Yeah, I got that. Okay, so we're coming up through here. That stuff's all done. Run through here. I do have some food on me in case I, you know, get hit by that gas. Now, or the electric fence. Now that I know how to go through the gas, though, I never get hit by it. So, that's fine. Alright, so let's come down here. There's usually something good in these chests. So, let's see what these got. Let's see what these got. By the way, if you see any chests I missed, please give me the timestamp and let me know. And if you see any crosses on the... Uh, ooh, that's not bad. I was going to say, no red ticket, but I got a gun, so that's pretty good. Um, if you see any crosses on the floor that I missed, I don't think, I don't see how I could miss them, but hey, it's me. You never know, right? So if you see any crosses on the floor of like corpses that I missed, uh, you know, let me know that as well. Oh, that's a pretty decent one right there. All right. Well, I'm getting, kind of getting full here. It's going to suck. I'm going to have to go up and uh, drop stuff off and come da back down. But, you know, it means I'm getting a lot of stuff. I just wish I was getting better stuff. Although, uh, you know, pistol's not bad. I'm getting a lot of tickets though. So let's see what we got. All right, so we are getting we're starting to get a little bit of aluminum, which is nice But let me do some transfers because I do want to walk out of here with everything. Okay, we are finally Finally back for the batteries Damned if I'm gonna leave those batteries behind I just know the next update that armor update is gonna be all about batteries We're probably gonna need batteries to run our armor. Ooh, you know what? That'd be pretty cool if We can make like mech suits or almost like power armor You know like the stuff in uh, fallout like power armor mech suit type things Mmm, that would be very, very nice. I could get into that. I'm just saying. That would be pretty freaking cool. Alright, what do you got for me, man? Give me some good stuff, please. Please. Eh. Eh. I, you know, I don't know. I'm starting to get to the point now where I can get yellow tickets every time. Like, I've got 50 yellow tickets. What does it take? 25? So I've got enough yellow tickets for this run and the next run. I'm starting to get into the problem with the green tickets. You know? So when I see a yellow ticket... I like the yellow tickets. I think it's pretty good. As a matter of fact, last time I turned the yellow ticket, I got a shotgun and a rifle. And tactical armor. I mean, yellow ticket's nice. It's not bad. Ooh, red ticket. Okay. That's actually really good. Um, so ye yellow tickets are nice, but it's just, you know, getting to the point where I have so many of them. Okay. So what do we got now? 36 or 37 red tickets. I'm actually thinking about next time. How many tickets do you think we get for a bunker run? Because I want to know, like, what I... How many... Oh, God. I extra yellow tickets now i want to know how many extra i'd have to have um you know i should probably start keeping track of how many how many tickets i get actually um when i come down here i have all my tickets with me um i think next time i come down here and i do a bunker run i'm gonna keep i'm gonna try to remember i'll probably forget but i'm gonna try to remember to keep my tickets separate uh so i can actually pay attention to how many i get down here um i don't think you get i think you might get about 20 I think you might get about 20. Definitely 15. You know? And probably 20. So I would say what I'm trying to figure out is how many extra red tickets do I have to walk out of here with to give myself a good shot at getting a red... Uh, I'm not going to call them combat gear coupons because I just can't do it. Anyway, um, red coupons. I'll, I'll try and call them coupons. Ticket would make so much more sense. But anyway. Um, yeah, how many more red, red coupons would I have to have over what I use to give myself a good shot at getting another, you know, red coupon turn in next video or next time I do the, next time I do the, um, the run, you know what I'm saying? So I think if you have 10, if you, if you walk out of here at 40 and you turn in 30, I think you have a good shot. 
Ooh, I could use that wrench. I think you have a good shot at getting another another set of uh, red coupon turn-ins next time. So I'm going to walk out of here probably. I'll probably get one more. So I'll probably walk out of here with about 40. Um, you know, 39 is pushing it. I don't think you're going to get 21. Um, I think 20 is actually kind of pushing it too. Did I loot this? I think I did, but I'm just going to make sure. I think, yeah, I did. I think 20 is actually pushing it as well. So, if you walk out of here with nine red coupons left, you're probably not going to get enough in your next run. Which kind of blows. Because it looks like I'm going to walk out of here with nine. Oh, man. Why you do this to me, game? Why you torture me? I've only got two more chests to open, so. I mean, I had a good, I had a good run there on chests with red coupons. But it's starting to dry up, so. Oh, cool. So, there's 40. So, I got a good shot. I got a good shot next video. All right. God, why do I keep saying next video? I got a good shot next time I do the bunker run. Actually, I got... No, I think this is the last one. Not including the gas mask. One. Okay. Right, we're starting to walk out here with a decent amount of aluminum, too. Which is nice. All right, guys. I've got room for stuff. I've got all the coupons split up. So I only have to bring what I have to bring. So I don't have any extra inventory room down here. Let's go see what we're going to get, guys. I'm freaking excited. This is the this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Time to turn in some coupons and get three chests. Awesome. We're gonna walk out of here at uh four or five seven guns. Seven guns. Alright, turn it in. Turn it in. And turn it in. Hell yeah, I love that chest, man. Alright, let's see what we got here. Okay, that is not bad. I can live with that. Pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, that's not bad. All right, what do you got for me? Um, that is not what I need. That is not what I need, people. Uh, and I got a pistol instead of a shotgun this time. So this one's kind of sucky, but that's all right. That's all right. Uh, we got a full set of tactical armor and a rifle and a pistol. It's not terrible. We got some aluminum. That's cool. Just uh, wish I'd get the right um, bike parts. Uh, well, I got an engine. Uh, the, the guns are, yeah. You know, rifle, shotgun, couple pistols. This one's modded. All right, not bad. Uh, we got the tactical armor and two sets of tactical armor. So we didn't get the um, we didn't get the SWAT gear this time. You know, that's all right. You, know, you don't really need the SWAT gear. Um, so that's not bad. Although these engines should really start dropping like two or three at a time because, like, damn, you need twenty of them for the. You need twenty engines for the bike, and you can only do it every three days. So if you start the bike from square one, oh no. Man, that, that is rough. That is really rough. All right, let's grab the gas mask, and let's head downstairs. Uh, we are hungry and thirsty, so that kind of stinks. Um, and I didn't leave any... Well, I left some of this down here. All right, that's going to have to be good enough. I really don't care. You're going to have to deal with it, you freaking little girl. Deal with it. I'm hungry. Somebody burped the baby. He's hungry. <laughs> I know, I'm mean. All right, fair enough, fair enough. All right, what are we going to get in here? Um, last time we did the gas mask room, it was a total bust, a complete waste of time and energy, and maybe we just got unlucky, or maybe the gas ra mask room is no good anymore. Let's take a look. All right, come to Papa. Give me some. Give me some good stuff. Man. Give me some engine parts. Give me some engine parts. Garbage. Okay, what do you got for me? <laughs> this is such a waste. Oh man. Hey, right, what do you got? What do you got? Engine parts. Uh, red coupon. Okay. So the red coupon makes that pretty decent. And that puts me up to 41 red coupons, which means uh, I have an outside shot at getting another red coupon turn in uh, the next time I do Alpha Bunker. So I think the next video is going to be us uh, working on solidifying our base against hordes. And um, as soon as this uh, bunker resets again, we will be doing it. All right. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I will see you next time. Till then, take it easy.